You know what? After years of building websites, I feel like WordPress with Elementor is the easiest, fastest way for anybody to build a business website, for example, like a dumpster rental website or junk and wool business. And I'll show you exactly how to make that happen. Super easy to do. What's up there, guys? Izzy here once again with Do-It-Yourself Junk Removal SEO, where I help junk removal companies, dumps and rental companies, small business owners really understand the internet, really know, understand website design, SEO, to get their business found online for the services they're providing. And today I'm going to discuss what I feel is the best website builder there is that, well, it's easy to work with, and it also is going to help get your business found online because it's built on WordPress. Uh, over the years, when I first started doing this, I was using Weebly to set up web websites. But over the years, I started realizing that WordPress just ranked better. And I started to need to learn how to use WordPress. So years ago, I started messing around. I took different courses. I learned from other people. And ultimately, I come up with the best way to build a website that I feel like anybody can build. You know, if you have the time to sit there and really do it, somebody were to guide you, it's not very difficult to do. And all you have to do is get WordPress hosting from either GoDaddy, from Bluehost, HostGator, all those big hosting companies have WordPress hosting. Just purchase that for the year, two years, whatever, attach your domain to it and start building your WordPress website. And how you do it is actually pretty simple. So you just need to go on here onto, let's go here. So when you have your WordPress website, it'll be a blank website. This one's already loaded up with some stuff, but you just go into themes, go into themes and then look for Hello Elementor. That's the one that I always use because it's super simple. And the reason I've been using this is because I wanted to show other people, business owners like yourself, how to build it from scratch. There's a bunch of themes out there. Some are really comp, some you pay money for. This is really simple. It makes your website fast. It makes it easy to build. And this is why I recommend Hello Elementor. So you just look for that theme, install it, and then activate it. And then that's it. You're done. Your theme is now the Hello Elementor theme for your WordPress website. Next thing you want to do is install the Elementor plugin. Your plugin, plugins are like apps for a phone, but these are like apps for your website. So you install the plugin. Elementor, the Elementor Builder, install that. You go in here, install plugins. You add new. This one already has it, but you just look for it. Elementor. Right? And it'll show up like this. Install it and then activate it, and then you're good to go. Now, this website I already have just messing around. I'm using this as an example here. But let's say you have a brand new page. Let's say home, right? You title that and you hit hello, Elementor, not hello, let me just hit, edit with Elementor. Just click on here on the settings part. I always go with full width. And then you can start to build. I know it seems really basic. They have some templates up here that you can use that they have. Some are free, some you pay for. This will help you get started. Or you could just start with adding little sections. So let's add like the header, for example, let's add a header. Let's add a picture. Hit style here, background overlay. Let's go with a picture. You add a picture. Let's put a picture of this demo work here. Let's make it bigger. Let's change the, the layout of it. And what you want to change is the height your minimum height, then you can set up your minimum height, whatever you want it to be. Four or 500. Uh, let's go with 500. There you go. And then let's say you want to add the title, right? You go on here. This is all the features that Elementor has. When you fiddle around with it for some time, you spend some time with it and all that stuff. It's, it's really, really easy to do. Uh, so here's your headline. Drag it. Drop it right in there. Bam. And remember, I always talk about the H1 title tag. This gives you the option to change that. So let's say junk removal um, Oakland, right? There it is. You just center it. 
You could change the font. Here's the style button. Change the color to whatever you want, right? You could add some shadow to it. Change the shadow to, let's make it red, right? You could take, change that shadow to, to be not as intense. Oops, let's go like this, stuff like that. You could change the size of this font. Let's see, with type typography here. So you could change the size, whoop, 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 just like that, whatever you want. There you go. And you could add even more text. Let's say you want to add a uh, text underneath here. Um, we, we are an awesome junk removal company in Oakland. We kick ass and charge cheap service. Right? So then you can change that too. See, so you saw small right here. You can go on here, hit style. Let's change this to black so it could pop. Boom. Typography. Let's change the size. Here. Let's make that 30. You center it right here. Or make it even smaller. You could go by individual. Whatever you want to do. See, so you could change whatever you want. You could also add the button. See, I have buttons right here. There you go. Let's center that button. Um, call us here. Call us. Now. Boom. Right? You can change the the button color too. Let's change that color to that. You could change the the text color on the button. Let's change the text color to oops. We don't want it black, so you can't see it. Boom. White. There you go. You can add a border to the color if you want. To the button. And you can change it right here. To a white border. Whatever you want. Red border. Right? And then here's the hover. So whenever you run your mouse across the button, you can change the color too. Let's keep the text um, white. Now the, the color of the button, let's change it to blue. All right? See? Now when people hover, it's blue. So there's so many things you could do. It's, it's freaking awesome. So now you want to add another section, right? Let's add another section. Um, let's make this one 400, right? And this is where you can add another title to it. That's good. Go ahead and add that on there. Boom. Okay. Now we can put on here. You need some junk removal in Oakland. Right? We can center that and check it out. Make that H2 title tag. Stuff like that. And then you could add little different sections too, like um an intersection right here. See that? So if you want to write a little paragraph here, another little paragraph here, the possibilities are endless. Let's say you want to add a picture here. Picture. Boom. All right. Picture. Boom. Stuff like that. So there's a, a million things you could do. And if you don't like anything, you'd always delete it. Just like that. Just like that. And then ultimately, what you can do with the Hello Ele the, the Elementor theme is you can start saving templates, things that you've created. You can save them and make it easy for you to build some. So there's some that I've created over the, my time building these websites. So let's say I started from scratch and I'm going to make this available with my course on how to build your own website. Um, you just save some templates. I have one that's completely saved. Here's my template. 
my junk removal website template, insert that entire template in there. And it's done. You got 90% of all your work done. There's the website. And I've created this template as well to make it easy for just about anybody to write the content for their website and make sure it's SEO optimized, make sure all the content that you need is on there. Everything's set up with your the template on here. So you can see here, junk removal in your city. Everything's completely set up already. Places for you to put your pictures, places for you to write the content, what makes you separate from it. It's a complete template already set up. So if you have a WordPress website, you download Elementor theme, um, the Hello Elementor theme, the Elementor builder, and all you have to do is take my template and place it into your site and you have things ready to rock and roll for your business. So you sit there and just build one of these websites yourself, change the background picture, all that stuff. And in my course, I'm going to show you guys step by step how you can do this for yourself. Uh, I always say it over and over again if you don't have the money more than likely you have the time to do something like this if you don't have the time more than likely it's because you're busy you're making money so then you can have pay the money to have somebody else do this for you so this is perfect um way for somebody who has time or somebody's barely starting out business barely starting out the dumpster rental business to build a website from scratch so that, that we can save their time and they can add all the information they want to the website add their own pictures to it get everything set up with Elementor theme. And this makes your website rank real, real well on uh, Google. Like this website here, uh, just finished it up not too long ago. It's probably not even indexed in Google yet. You make really nice looking websites just like this one here. And you got some websites that show up on Google just because they're so well built. And if he, let's see, like this guy here, I built his website. Um, and he's ranking already on Google just because of the website. It's a really well website designer here, Menifee Junk Removal Services. Um, I build it for him, but again, you could do this for yourself if this is something you're looking to do. Like I said, I provide the entire template as long as well as the service pages, the about page, and the contact page, everything to set your website up. So that's why I liked Elementor and with WordPress. It helps your website rank on Google and get your business found online. So that's all I got for you guys for today. You guys wanna learn more about my little course, my training, everything you need to do to build the stuff yourself, or if you want me to do this stuff for you, feel free to reach out to me in my uh, description here. I'm gonna have all the links, examples, all that good stuff. And that's all I got for you guys for now. Till next time.